Transducer University pro tip. Let's talk about in-hull transducers and the maintenance around them. They are the perfect alternative to a through-hull or a transamount transducer and they're great for solid core fiberglass boats where you don't want to drill a hole or put something on the transom. Here's how they work. The actual body of the, of the transducer itself is epoxied or fiberglass to the inside of the hull. And then that well, once it cures, that well is filled with an eco-friendly coolant. The face of the transducer itself sits inside the, the, the well and in that coolant. Now, chirp transducers, they, they do create heat, so the coolant acts as a great cooling agent, but it also acts as a bonding agent and a good medium to transmit through, so you're getting the best bond with the fiberglass itself. One thing we want to do is maybe at the beginning of the season, maybe mid-season, we want to just pull the screws out. We want to look to make sure that the coolant's at the right level and then re-secure it once, the, once it is. I can guarantee you if you do that, you're going to get great performance out of your Airmar Chirp Transducer.